Congress isn't having a great day, Rahul Gandhi, who was to kick-start his poll campaign in Kolar, will have to wait another week as his event now stands postponed to the 16th of April. This is the third postponement of Rahul Gandhi's event. And as per sources, Rahul Gandhi's rally is getting postponed in Kolar as the Congress is yet to decide upon the name of its candidate from that constituency. Well, there is a suspense over Sidra Maya's name as the Congress candidate from Kolar. However, in view of the party's rule of one person, one ticket, the final decision has been left to the party high command to finalize the name of the candidate. Rahul Gandhi's visit uh, uh, to Kola has been postponed for the third time. What can I say? I can laugh about it. My colleague Neha is joining us live to give us more details. Neha, Rahul Gandhi, who was set to kickstart his poll campaign in Kolar, will have to wait another week as his event now stands postponed. And well, at this point of time, we also know that uh, his rally getting postponed in Kolar as the Congress is yet to decide upon the name of their candidate from that constituency itself. Yes, that's right. You know, while, of course, we're still awaiting the exact reason for the postponement of Rahul Gandhi's Yatra in Kolar, uh, what we're now picking up is that, you know, it has been pushed to the 16th of uh, April, uh, wherein, you know, you would, of course, have the Congress leader coming there and kick-starting the uh, Satyameva Jayate Yatra that the Congress has called it. They've gone on to say that, you know, they would be starting it from the exact spot where Rahul Gandhi had made a speech. In fact, you know, of course, a couple of years back uh, in that place in Kolar, which landed him in quite some trouble now. But uh, as far as as you know, of course, the Congress party is concerned. On a side note, we're also seeing that the list of candidates right now is yet to be finalized, the third list. And of course, this would include the crucial district of Kolar as well. It has been in the limelight now for quite some time because questions have been raised about whether former Chief Minister of Karnataka, Sidramaya, would be contesting from there as a second seat. Uh, that is, of course, you know, something that uh, the Congress party is still kept under the wraps right now. But we'll keep an eye out on that and, you know, really, of course, see uh, how things pan out now.